All right, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Dreamforge 1. Here on my channel, Idle Wisdom, we're picking up here in the Wooded Valley. We just finished meeting with Astrov and the rest of the Shaolai who were here. We carried uh, Masha's message and found out that he's okay, although he want, is kind of trapped here without allies, and he would benefit from having some one of the Servile factions to be to ally with. And so we told him we would help him with that, and he gave us a lot of information about the, the areas to the north and to the northeast. We also learned more about, you know, we know of various facilities and routes to get past those guarded bridges to get up to the, where the Gene Forge is. We learned more about the Gene Forge, that it is basically like the Crystal Canisters, only much more powerful and comprehensive. We heard again about Gish, the shaper, shaper who is to the northwest. We should probably try to meet him at some point, see what he can tell us. But for now, we need to go see if we can... We should probably... Hmm. We need to go f see if we can talk to one of these ally, these servile factions. And if we can't, get, one of the, get them to ally with the... Hey, help the shit shall I yeah help the the friendly shall I I wonder if the awakened would be willing to help we can talk to what's his name what's this dude's name I can't even remember his name Elra let's talk to Elra is he in here I can't even remember it's been forever since we talked to Elra and if not him maybe leader Kobar. welcome Shaper we fight for freedom um, he has nothing to say about it. Nope. All right. Well, thanks a lot. Thank you, Crosses Ponada. All right. Let us go talk to leader. Kobar. Maybe leader Kobar can help us. And if not that, then we'll go to the to Pentel and talk to the leader of the Obeyers. Um, leader Rydell. So let's see what maybe leader Kobar will help. I don't actually know. I think Avodius likes the Awakened a little bit better than the Obeyers, although he doesn't really have a problem with the Obeyers either. I think he likes the Obeyers and the, uh, the Awakened. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Tell me your village. You said you were Awakened. I want to learn more about the island. What dangers do you face? I read boat. Nope. Okay. Well, there's nothing to do here. All right. Well, sorry to waste your time. Gracias por nada. Hmm. One thing I'm do I do wonder, should we tell the should we t inform on the spies that are hiding here? There's that spy I don't remember what his name is. Nab, I think he is. Here, hiding in Vakery, who wants us to kill Elra. And there's that. Is it Dinah? Uh, I don't know. There's another s s taker in Elra's keep, the cook, who wants us to kill Elra. <laughs> Everyone wants to kill Elra. It's like, geez, the wheeze, dudes. So we'll see if Leader Right um, Rydell will help. I bow before you, Shaper. Obey the Shapers! We know that one uh, sniff. She's an obeyer, so maybe, maybe he will help. And he's right nearby. And the obeyers are pretty powerful, and they are definitely able to hold their own against the the takers. At least right now. Rydell stares at you openly, in awe of one of the beings he has been taught to follow all his life, but has never actually seen. Yes, Shaper. We obeyers are ever eager to aid you. All right. Well, there are some outsider humans hiding to the north. I feel they are following. The true will of the shapers. You should help them. Um, Evodius, I want to point out, you say, I think they are following. Not I feel. You can't feel that sort of thing. I'm just kidding. Well, no. Anyways. 
The North? Close to here? We had no idea. This is strange. It is hard to think any outsider in lands barred by the Shapers could mean for the true will to come further into being. I think Avodius kind of agrees with that, but we will meet with them, and maybe we could find some common ground. Alright. Alright. Well, let's see. Let's go tell Astroff what we've done. Hopefully, we haven't just gotten them killed. Because the obeyers take it pretty seriously that, you know, the fact that outsiders are not supposed to be on barred islands. Granted, shapers aren't supposed to be on them either, unless the barring has been revoked. But, you know, if anyone's supposed to be here, it's, it's a shaper, not, not an outsider. <laughs> of course, the takers don't give a rat's rear about, you know, whether this island's barred or not. Let's see. Do you have anything else to say? Nope, nope. All right. Everybody in. Everybody in. Yeah, it must be really kind of crazy. Kind of creepy, maybe even. For the chalet. All these creations just coming in and just chilling. I don't know. What else do you want? He's trying to speak slowly and simply, but his accent still makes it difficult to understand. I have spoken with Rydell, the leader of Pentel. He is loyal to the Shapers, and he might help you. <laughs> might. Then I will go down there to meet him. It will be hard, but I might convince him that we have a common cause. Thank you, Shaper. You have been a great help to us. All right, good. To be honest, we got 20 experience. Oh, whoop de doo Thanks a lot. Wow, we have 21 experience. Oh, yeah, well, 15,000 and 21. 21 towards the next level. Uh, whatever. I think he should take, maybe he'll take Sniff along with him, since I think she's a, yeah, she's an obeyer. We can tell from her dialogue about foul takers and shapers coming to save us. <laughs> Whereas, you know, usually the awakened call them kind of mad or overly, you know, upset, overwrought, you know, dangerous, unpredictable. The obeyers are just like, no, they're evil and bad. <laughs> All right, now let's talk to Rydell again. Let's see what he has to say. Hopefully, Everything went according to plan. And they didn't just kill the, the Shaolai. I wonder what happens if you actually go and kill the rebel Shaolai for Echo Blade. I've never done that, to be honest. I've, I mean, I've never beaten this game, but I've gotten almost to the end before, but I don't know. Okay, I bow before you. Oh, yep. Okay. Nothing else. Huh. Alright, well, whatever. I guess they... Nothing yet. Whatever, man. Okay, let's go tell Masha that we found... What's his face? Astroth. The refugee cave. Yep, yep, yep. Masha, Masha. We did what you asked. We want treasure or something. I don't even know. Give us something good. I wonder what's in these chests and pots. Alright. I have met Astro. He is doing well. Marvelous news. I am glad he is able to help you. Trust him in his wisdom. If you want to deal with traitor Chajkov, 
you should speak much with speak with Ostrov much. He knows more than me now of the way things are. Huh. All right. Well, is there anything else here? Anything else? Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, yep, nope, nope. Nothing else. Alright, well we got 20 points for that. Better save my game right quick. Save my game right quick. Can't... What's... Oh, nah. It's just a bunch of... Bunch of stuff. There is a heavy, worn sea chest here. It has obviously seen many long journeys. Oh, I guess we still have the key. Unlock the chest. The chest was locked. Fortunately, the key you found at the docks unlocks it. Um, open it. You open the chest. Inside, you find salty, dirty clothes, some broken scrimshaw, and an old, battered journal. I don't know what scrimshaw is. I wonder. I'll have to look that up at some point. You flip the an old, battered journal. You flip through it and find that with concentration, you can understand it. It was the journal of Anfisa, the assistant and advisor to Trajkov. They were leading an expedition across an unexplored sea. They started with three ships, the storm left them with two. When they reached Susha Island, they were starving without hope. Land and fall at Susha cost them a second ship. Once they landed, Trajkov led an expedition ashore. There, he and Anfisa found a huge shaper research facility. It was in the mountains at the northeast corner of the island. The tunnels prov provided shelter for all the sailors as they stocked up on food and tried to figure out where to go from there. While this process continued, Trajkov and Enfisa would explore the research chambers, translate their documents, and figure out who the Shapers were and what they were doing. It was at this point that Anfisa's entries get shorter and more vague. Perhaps she was afraid that Trajkov would read her journal. She was clearly concerned with how events were developing. Andela 17. Trajkov has figured out how to use the canisters. He places a hand on top of one, and it changes him. If the Shaper writings are to be believed, they are reworking his genes. I don't know what those are. Andela 21. Trajkov has used eight canisters. I have used none, despite his urgings. They are changing him. He can use magic now. He never could before. It is strange. Andela 28. Trajkov grows angry very easily now. He has used every canister we have found. The current total is 20. Oh my goodness. And I, that I know of. Vit 3. We have penetrated the deepest chambers. We believe we have located the, the gene forge, referred to often in Shaper writings. Trajkov thinks we should use it. He should use it. Vit 8. Trajkov is frustrated. His anger is frequent. He is missing something. He said he needs some gloves. I am not sure if he meant gloves. His speech is strange sometimes. Vit 15. We know that Shapers passed this island in their living ships. Trajkov has a plan. He will abduct one using our soul ship. Or maybe this plan is already taking place. Many are loyal and he speaks with me less. He uses more canisters. Others use them too. They are loyal and strong and they get angry easily. We've seen this in ourselves, getting angry for really very little provocation. Vit 20. We have a shaper. It is called Gish. It talks to Trajkov. It. Wow. I don't know what they say. Trajkov doesn't involve me. I know they are talking about the Gene Forge. Vit 25. Trajkov and Gish spe spend lots of time in the Gene Forge shapers. Some of us wonder when we Wonder when we will continue our mission. We have food. The boat is ready. Some are restless. We know, though, that Trajkov's path is the wisest. Oh, wow, yeah. <laughs> of course. Of course it's the wisest. Just like, you know, the, the, the takers are always wise. Keep reading. Ermin 1. Gesh has left. He has taken something from Trajkov. Trajkov is furious. He called me in to see the Gene Forge. He wants me to hunt down and kill Gesh. Gesh is hiding in the waste to the east. To the east, I would think to the west. I told Trajkov I would kill Gesh. He showed me the Gene Forge. It has several power columns around it. Trajkov told me to stay away from them. They are unstable, he said, and can destroy the whole place. Well, that's some good information. So, the Gene Forge, it has several power columns around it. 
told me to stay away from them. They are unstable, he said, and could destroy the whole place. Alright, so if we absolutely need to, we can destroy the Gene Forge, perhaps, by messing with the power columns around the Gene Forge. Ermin 10. I have not yet left to hunt Gesh. Trajkov accused me of not wanting to. Uh, suggesting we continue our mission infuriates him. He has stopped using the canisters, but he didn't say why. Actually, I need to hit record. I'm gonna have this page so I can look at it again, in case I forget. Ermin 25. Trajkov has returned. He and his assistants explored the island. They said they laid traps and created controlling things and did diplomacy. He did not elaborate. That's probably with the, the takers. Ermin 27. Trajkov has set his new plan in motion. He will abduct a new shaper, a weaker one. Hey, who can be molded? We will anger these strange and powerful people even more. I'm sure this is the wisest course. <laughs> of course. Herman 28. My own plans have come to be. As I write this, we are rowing away from Trajkov and his loyal mad minions. At last, I can write freely. Trajkov is mad. Why is he doing what he's doing? Where, where did his lust for power come from? I do not know. I know this, though. We must stop him. We must return to our mission, our good mission of exploration and peace. We will land near a servile village. They call it Kosk. Hopefully they will know nothing of Trajkov or his plans, and we can enlist their help. We have been sighted. The ship is following us. There are docks ahead, though. We will land and disappear into the tunnels. It is a risky path, but I don't think they will give chase. We threw fire at the sails. They did not risk the ship. They will not risk the ship. The journal ends. All right, we know that. Nonetheless, while they did make it into those tunnels, and Fissa was killed by the Trajkovs or his people, maybe, maybe it was uh, she was, you know, shooting fire at the ship until the rest of them got into the into the caves, but and then she got killed. I don't know. All right, you close the book and carefully replace it in the sea chest. Well, there we know. Wow. Sound like Trajkov was power crazy from the. The canisters and what he learned about the gene forge and he's in the business of kidnapping shapers which is no good okay let's see anything else da, 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 da. all right no 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 all right cool well, let's see what happens if i try to open this will she say don't do that oh 18 living tools jeez louise well we could do that but i don't know not right now Alright, well, that's all we need to do here. I did just. Oh, jeez. No, no, Avodius. Not by yourself. Dumb dumb. I just noticed that we did not explore this little cave entrance right here. That is all we have to do right here with the Shao Life for now. We're gonna have to do some more exploring and fighting. But what is here? More robes, more traps, nothing, tra -la, la oh it was some nests, probably for battle alphas. Oh there's a living tool and speed pod, nice. How about you? 65 coins, not bad. Essence pod and a curing spores. Alright, not bad at all. Alrighty, well, I think We now need to figure out where we're going to go next. Ooh, yeah. Oh, pardon me. Okay, so let's see, where do we have? We have these icy tunnels. We could go there. Hmm. This would lead up. Because remember, northeast of Kaz, Astroff said there's some trapped mines. There's a trapped mine shaft or mining tunnels over here. So we probably have to go through these icy tunnels. Here is one of the bridges, the guarded bridge, another guarded bridge. Those are pretty, pretty tough. This is the path north. But Peaceful Vale, the free place. That's where those battle alphas that we helped was were. And then here's the power station. That's a, another tough area, although we could probably do it. Dear Azad, not right now. 
I don't think, anyways. Ancient Crypt. Although maybe I'm wrong. Maybe we could do Diarazad. I don't know. Ancient Crypt is very powerful. And then there's finally Spirit City. Now, I think Geish is somewhere up here. They said in the northwest. But to get up there, we have to be able to get through the Spirit City. And that means being able to get past those battle betas. And they kind of pulverized me when I tried to get... I don't remember if I, I included that in the episode or not. But they, pull, they, they beat me to a pulp <laughs> last time I tried that. So, I think maybe... Maybe we'll try one of these other ways first. Maybe we can give these icy tunnels a quick look-see. I mean, maybe they, they won't be helpful at, a, at all. Oh, I know what this place is. Okay, this is a dangerous place too. Jeez, everything is dangerous now. What's this? The people who once inhabited this island left a number of these pylons around. You aren't sure what they were for. Although they are all very worn, some of the original writing and carving survive. Unfortunately, you don't understand them. All right, well, whatever. I think this place is full of shades. Yep, yep, don't understand them. whoop de doo Oh, wow. What's this lead to? That leads to the underground river. Oh, that opened that up right quick. Well, that's good. Well, we don't have too much time left in this episode, so we'll just take a quick look around a little bit. I think next episode we'll try seeing if we can go into those tunnels, those icy tunnels. Oh, who are you? I, Dotia? Avdotia, you meet one of the outsider humans, the leader of the small group guarding this narrow pass. She points at herself and says, Avdotia of the Shaolai. She is very confused and nervous. She clearly didn't expect to see you. Do you understand me? You respond that you speak a little bit of her tongue. She nods. You must go back. You cannot pass here. You understand. Your understanding of her speech is imperfect but adequate. What? Why can't I pass here? These are orders of Trajkov. He says no shapers can pass beyond. Who's Trotskov? Trotskov is the leader. He says who may pass our post and who may return. If, he want, if you want to pass, you must see Trotskov. He is north in Big Mountain. He wants to see you. Oh, really? What is pass here? I cannot say. Hmm. Well. Avdotia watches you nervously. That's interesting. How strong are they? Eh, they're... Well, uh, keep back. Okay, there's a... There's probably a fair group of them. Do we want to attack them? I don't know. Hmm. I think, for now, I will... Hold off. However... Ah, uh, I don't know. They seem pretty arrogant. Although, she seems to be just following orders. But... Trajkov has another thing coming. He can, thinks he can tell shapers where they can go on shaper lands. I think we're going to have to deal with Trajkov. These tunnels are extremely cold. Extremely old. Dug out of the hillside long ago by crude tools. These warrens clearly predate the shaper settlement here by some centuries. They were probably made by the tribes who once lived on this island long ago. The tunnels are icy cold. Frost covers the floor, walls, and ceiling. There are no tracks in the white crystals. No one has entered here for quite a while. Inside it is very quiet. Hmm. All right, well, that looks scary. Oh, it looks like these three don't want to go in there. They're like, uh -uh. Well, I think I'm going to call it an episode right here. Next time we will go into these icy caverns. Who knows, maybe we can find another way around those Shaolai and uh, see what they're up to anyways. What they're blocking. I, what are they blocking, I wonder? All right, cool. Actually, let's just take a look on the map right quick. 
right quick. I want to see where is this? Okay. Huh. Oh, maybe this goes down into the. It must go to the dock. These docks. Oh, I see. This would allow us to get to the docks. I get it. Okay. Huh. Where that ship is. That last ship. Or a boat of any of any sort. Some sort of small boat. All right. Cool. Yeah. Trajkov wants to talk to us or wants to capture us, and he doesn't want us to, Evodius here, to, to escape. All right, cool. All right, well, next time we will continue onward. Thank you for joining me on this episode of my Let's Play of Gene Forge 1 here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. Take care, y'all.